Hello, I am Dr. Naresh Biyani, a senior pediatric neurosurgery consultant attached at uh, SRCC Children's Hospital managed by Narayan Health. Today, I am going to discuss about uh, spina bifida or spinal dysophism, but the better word is tethered cord syndrome. When we talk about tethered cord, it means that the spinal cord that should be lying at its normal level at L1, L2 junction is uh, held down because of some congenital conditions. Uh, God has been very kind and gives the external cutaneous marker through which a pediatrician or a referring doctor can diagnose that and can be investigated. The cutaneous stigmata that we see uh, in a child is usually a swelling in the back, a lipoma uh, swelling or a patch of hair or a dermal sinus or sometimes even uh, open neural tube defects are presented with the CSF leak. Once the spina bifida is diagnosed, uh, we usually do a MRI study of a lumbosacral spine that would tell us whether the spinal cord is low lying, has lipoma, or sometimes rarely the bony bar in between the spinal cord. Untreated, these children develop neurological deficit that leads to the weakness in the lower limb and also neurogenic bladder and bowel, leading to the loss of control of urine and stool. We at SRCC hospital operate these children prophylactically at around six months of age. And uh, we have uh, all the modern neurosurgical gadgets, including microscope and neuroelectrophysiological neuromonitoring that we utilize during the surgery. Our uh, aim of treatment in a prophylactic surgery is to prevent a complication that would have happened with the natural history of the disease if operated at early stage appropriately. We at uh, SRCC Children's Hospital managed by Narayan Health also run a spina bifida clinic that is a multi-speciality clinic where children with uh, spina bifida or tethered cord having multiple problems like a neurogenic bladder or a pediatric neuroorthopedic deformity and uh, the other physiotherapy issues are tackled at one roof. The clinic is on Monday afternoon. If you see a child with spina bifida, uh, you can contact our hospital. Thank you.